In my class, I like to do a rhythm activity with my students. I divide the students into groups and I give each group an envelope. And inside the envelope are a ton of tiny little pieces with little bits of notes and rhythms. Students are able to use a number line that they use for a measure to build a bunch of different rhythms. This activity worked great in my class, except I noticed after one class period, little tiny bits of the papers were getting missing or lost. And then when another group tried to use the same packet with the tiny little cutouts of notes and rhythms, they were missing pieces and couldn't always complete the activity. It was a great activity. Students were able to understand rhythms and were able to build their own rhythms. It, it was great, it was amazing. I love the hands-on approach. But because of all the pieces constantly getting lost, it was losing its effectiveness. I decided to create an online version of the same activity. I used Google Slides to make tiny little squares with rhythms and I made the number line. And then I put that assignment in Canvas where students can open up the slide and drag around the notes to put them on the number line to make their own rhythms. This worked so much better online than it did in person with the tiny bits of paper. First of all, nothing was lost, of course, because it was all on the computer. It was really easy for students to manipulate the Google slide and to move the boxes where they needed to go. And each student was able to participate because they each were able to do the activity on their own Chromebook. This activity was way more effective online than it was in person.